India cares for rare diseases. Human body is composed of millions of cells. Each cell contains the same complement of DNA constituting the human genome. DNA stores our genetic code in an elegant double helix. DNA is made up of four building blocks called nucleotides, adenine, thiamine, guanine, and cytosine. DNA uses these four letters, A, T, G, C, to make all the proteins required for our body. The DNA sequence of every person's genome is the blueprint for their development from a single cell to a complex integrated organism. We can write different kinds of books using 26 letters from A to Z. Similarly, DNA creates different human beings using these four letters A, T, G and C. As we can make mistakes while writing, similarly, DNA can also make some mistakes when it has to replicate itself. And that is what we call mutation. The mutation changes the gene's instructions for making a protein. So the protein does not work properly or is missing entirely. This can cause a medical condition called a genetic disorder. You can inherit a gene mutation from one or both parents. Rare genetic disorders are chronic debilitating conditions that lead to a lot of morbidity and mortality. Only 5% of rare diseases worldwide are treatable. The Center for DNA Fingerprinting and Diagnostics, CDFD, Hyderabad, has initiated an interdisciplinary approach to decode the genetic mutations that cause pediatric rare genetic disorders. Program. This is a Pan India initiative funded by the Department of Biotechnology, Ministry of Science and Technology, Government of India. About 70 million people in India suffer from various uh, rare genetic disorders due to endogamy and consanguineous marriage. Therefore, the aim of the program is to understand the genetic basis of some of the rare diseases. Once we identify the genetic mutations, that would be conveyed to the family and appropriate genetic counseling would be given. Therefore, this disease can be avoided in future generation. In addition, we are also planning to do therapeutic attempt for some of the rare diseases. And mostly, uh, we wanted the public to be part of this program. Therefore, they would get benefit out of this program. CDFD has developed state-of-the-art facility to study the pediatric rare genetic diseases. Scientists at the CDFD perform whole exome sequencing WES, whole genome sequencing WGS, analysis of sequence data, functional validation of the novel genes and variants. A database of phenotype genotype is being developed to determine which gene or mutations cause rare disease condition. CDFD is also developing novel and affordable methods for diagnostics and screening of rare genetic diseases. There is often little that can be done by parents to prevent occurrence of all genetic disorders. But genetic testing and counseling can help them to learn more about the disease and its management. It can also let them know about the likelihood of passing the disorders on to their children. Realizing the need for adequate and effective genetic testing and counseling services, CDFD has brought together teams of clinical experts in a nationwide network of cutting-edge facilities with the goal to provide specialized care in disease management for people living with rare disease. The CDFD is collaborating with pediatric departments of medical colleges, DBT, Umid centers and 16 centers across India to analyze samples from children with rare genetic disorders and their parents. We plan to use telemedicine for recruitment of patients from 16 different collaborating centers throughout the country in the mission program. We will be doing exome sequencing for more than 5000 families with various rare genetic disorders 
and then try to find the cause of the genetic disorder in these families. The database of sequence variations along with phenotype of Indian pediatric patients will be of great value to genetic diagnostic laboratories within and outside India. The capacity built and resources developed during the course of this project will serve as a platform to facilitate similar studies in India. The mission program will positively contribute towards mitigating the societal burden of genetic diseases.